Supreme Court weighs whether to throw out the state's current legislative maps. The case could change the future of Wisconsin politics. Jason Calvi looks at the battle over your place on the maps. A supremely important case. Almost half or a little over half of the assembly districts in our state have a constitutional violation. So why don't we start clean? Liberals ask Wisconsin justices to toss maps drawn by Republicans. They want all legislators to face election in 2024, even those whose terms run through 2026. I can't imagine something less democratic than unseating most of the legislature that was duly elected last year. I, I have to say that I agree it's an extreme remedy. Tell me, is there any precedent for using a writ that would oust such a big chunk of the state legislature? I don't know of any. The Supreme Court decided the current maps in 2022. That was before the court flipped to the liberals. During this year's campaign, Janet Protosiewicz called the maps rigged. Everybody knows that the reason we're here is because there was a change in the membership of the court. This case centers on the Wisconsin constitutional requirement that districts be of contiguous territory. Liberals say these islands break the clear meaning of the text. There's like a total of seven in the country. Wisconsin has 75. Uh, this, is, this shocks people across the country who look at this map. Conservatives say the legislative islands like these have been approved in maps for 50 years and that it's due to annex cities or keeping towns together. The governor himself proposed a remedy with municipal islands and this court took it. The justices did not say when they'll issue their decision in this case, but the clock is ticking. We're less than one year away from election day. Here at the Capitol in Madison, Jason Calvi, Fox 6 News. Jason, thank you. And Wisconsin's recent presidential elections have been decided by less than a point. But Senate Republicans have a supermajority. And in the Assembly, they are just two seats short. That could all change if the court does strike down these current maps.